Well. Wait a minute. Then what are these for? off lasers somewhere. Not there. I turned off these side lasers, so there's that. these mirrors even for? They ought to be for something, right? I turned off the spawns. the last one. There we go. Die. 
die, please. Yay, I did it! Huzzah! Now please tell me I can rest out here. Thank goodness. Gotta eat those pears. What exactly I did by doing that, I don't know, but I did it. Better believe I did it. Okay, so we accomplished that. Now we have to go back up to the upper golem factory, which was where we were with the uh, dancing laser grids of death. And apparently there is another area that is open now. Not these dancing laser grids of death. Those dancing laser grids of death. I like doing more than this. Have to babysit my guys. Thank you, game. Thanks for that. Exactly where I wanted you to be. Because you were all in a line, exactly where I wanted. But no, we gotta go over here. It's perfect. You clearly know what I want more than I do. Freaking game. Okay. Apparently there's a north exit here somewhere? No wait, no. Upper Golem Factory from there goes south along the westernmost tunnel till you get to the first laser beam, then there's a staircase going up. Oh! I already saw that staircase, I just never took it. If I had been paying attention, I think that's what that la fourth spire was that unlocked the door. Yeah, see, it turned that off. alpha on it. Anyway, here we are. And this floor, on this floor, we can turn off all the lasers. That's what I know. Apparently it's also kind of cold. Star. 
Reach the highest level of the Golem Spire. This large hall is dominated by a pair of massive pieces of machinery. They rise to the ceiling and through it. It appears that not all the factory's power comes from volcanic vents underneath it. The spires seem to be trying to draw bolts of blue energy out of the air above the tower. Once in a while, a small wave of lightning will crackle down one of the spires and into the floor, casting off little bolts of fire as it travels. Is very little energy, though, for so massive of a receiver. You must have succeeded in cutting off the power from outside the tower. It will be safe to pass through this chamber. Neato Torpedo. Hands of power? Oh, frick. Tell me about these pants of power. Okay. Didn't I enchant his pants to be magic resistant too? Continues to. He's almost completely immune to fire. He's very resistant to magic. He's just ready. Through this lab, is he still active and fully. Ch Though this laboratory is still active and fully charged, it hasn't been used in a while. All the beams are focused to power one pad. Golem raw materials are scattered everywhere. Maybe golems were made here once and the technique was too inefficient. I do believe uh, that we are not supposed to step on those green things, or bad happens. Dang it, sorry. Give that to Jeremy. Potion. Too heavy. Dang it. Um. We are one pound shy. Less than a pound shy. That one was particularly cold. Don't argue. More of the same? Okay. Same. Oh. 
almost the same stuff, except the golems are here. What happened to these golems? You've gone downhill, golems. Okay, I've got to step on these runes, but I do believe if I step on one of these green runes, golems will be everywhere. Oh well, got to do it. Step on this rune, it triggers an alarm! The hooting and screeching only lasts for a few seconds, but you are certain that it was audible to everyone and everything on this level. You're echoing through the halls, a cacophony of magical explosions. It's a familiar sound, the sound of golems being made. coming from over here too. And over here, and over here, over here, over here, over here. They're swarming and converging. Behind us, there's a jeweled golem. Hi guys. I saw a, uh... Um... Hi? Interesting. In this smoky hall, a network of beams pours energy into a set of four crystals. They look just like inert blocks of rock, but whenever the beams activate, you think you can hear the faint chattering of conversation. Some of the talking seems to come from the crystal pillars, but most of it is coming from the hall to the north. You can't understand the language. Don't mind me. Finally entered the highest chamber in the Golem's Infernal Factory. Before you were unsure who was controlling the Golems, or how they were doing it, things suddenly became clear. To the west you see an enormous crystal. It's similar to